hello guys what's up and i'm back with a new video of class royal and you can see currently i am at 65 6725 and you can see i am in global 1830 and let's see in local um, let's see where a top five or not yeah currently a top five that's pretty good right now and you can see which deck i'm playing is mega knight and balloon deck which is pretty awesome in this ladder deck uh, you can see my activity log i have played against expo against the hard counter pekka deck with the tom sorry with a tornado and electro wizard and arrows on it you can think how hard that match was but i am i was i still made that and won that easily with the lava on deck with a fireball and balloon you can see with the hog rider deck with the lightning it was easy when you can see a graveyard and giant deck i have played against each and every cards against that and you can see another balloon freeze deck with the e-drag that was also quite good match you can see the, again giant and the graveyard and these are the tournaments that i won with two bill two bill wins and i think this player was quite good player yeah this match was quite good let's hop into this match let's see replay and we'll go into the live matches Let's see one of two videos because this match were quite good against this player and this player was also quite high and skilled players. You can see how he played the expo was pretty awesome. You managed to play so close but I still managed to win this match. You can see he just played and he was cycling his expo right now because he didn't have the expo in his first card. So I just did activated the king tower with the inferno dragon and use the tesla out there so i went with a balloon in the right hand lane you can see here balloon and minor but i tried to did that but use the expo so i went with the mega knight right now currently mega knight yeah and i knew that he had only a knight and archer so i just went with the minor uh yeah minor and i just leave it and he did pretty good defense among that because he just took a little bit of damage of minor and that was a pretty good defense by him but we were less in elixir in comparison to him you can see he has a 5 elixir and we are a far elixir he just waited to cycle the expo again and i was just hoping for the mega knight but i couldn't have cycled too much like him so he's again you he will be probably going expo so i already went with this Nufono Dragon, so you will probably go to the expo. So I went to the Ice Golem right now and cycled the Mega Knight again. So he couldn't pressure me. And the expo is, isn't still connected into the tower right now. Uh, yeah, we defended that pretty well right now, up to now. But you can see the match was pretty good with him. And here we win, go with the minions, I think. Yeah. We went with the minions and minor for cheap damage because we need to get a cheap damage with the expo players uh, because if he doesn't the expo players can tie a match if they want but he, he already went with again expo so i just went with the balloon and the expo got connected into my tower and i zapped that so that the expo get connected to the ice golem you can see he's he's playing quite aggressive with the expo and expo players should be quite aggressive because if they don't play aggressive they would pretty easily lose the match so here you again cycling some stops and i'm cycling and i'm at mega knight so i don't need to worry about the expo right now i have a mega knight and balloon for expo although if i was the balloon gets touched on the expo and that's the expo is over so again he went with the full full cards but he is still unmanaged to get the expo lock you can see how we defended with mega knight and balloon and here he again cycling the expo because right now we don't have anything for expo you can see he out cycled me i was forced to use minor and zap there but if he had fireball there you would have currently got the tower i think but we still managed to play with him the match is still on he again went with i think he'll go with defensive right now we went the mega knight in attacking more we again with mega knight balloon and minor for archers i think he will probably fireball that yeah will my minor and the tower is connected in the minor we zap that and we got the touch that is that's the crucial touch we required so you can see we have a mega knight and on cycle so it is a pretty easy defense for us right now because we already took him took his tower a lot low so we'll go in defensive mode not attacking We'll try to defend everything. We try to get the expo first. 
so here you can see we'll probe easily we got the minor there zap and one more shot away from we win okay he defended that quite well though but that's the gg because i only need a zap and a minor shot and you will probably go with the expo currently so i went with the mega knight predictive so that was quite close and you can see that's easy matchup for us so against expo it's pretty hard for them to win for us so here's the easy win against mysterious of clan miracle Let's see this mess up because this is the hardest mess up. He's also a 19 win player and he has a finish of 1903. So this was also a pretty good player. You can see he's 18, 18 wins, tournament bats, everything. A gradual player. He is neither too bad. He has 17 wins, great, grand challenge winner. Everybody is a great player. I mean, good players. Which I want to look at 18 wins. He is playing also awesome 6600. So let's watch one P.E.K.K.A match and let's go into the battle, okay? We'll watch one P.E.K.K.A match and we'll go into live matches. If you see his deck that he has each and every counters for our cards like P.E.K.K.A for Mega Knight, Arrows for Minion Earth and Tornado for our Balloon. So you can see it's pretty hard for match up for us but I am still managed to win this match. I don't know how but still managed we won the match. You can see he just played the Electro Wizard and we just cycled the Inferno Dragon. As soon as he went with the P.E.K.K.A there I rushed into the right lane. He used, he ha I, I had forced him to use the arrows so he had to defense here. So here you can see how you play this deck. And I know he doesn't have arrow or anything else, so I went with a minion horde there. So you can see it's an easy defense for us. So I again went with aggressive uh, ice golem there because I know he doesn't have a arrow, so he was forced to use electro wizard again. So this is how you play. How you have to play this deck, you have to learn and you have to do a practice as well as you need to know what cards the opponent plays each and every cycle of opponent everything you need to care of so here you can see you will probably going with the pick oh uh, sorry you'll go with the dark prince i think no yeah we went aggressive with balloon knowing that he doesn't have electro wizard and tornado because he just used the electro wizard and tornado now he might be going a graveyard yeah he used the arrows and graveyard both so i thought we have lost lost the tower but we were still managed to not get the tower i think a low SP was remained on our tower that is a 44 SP remained so we are not too worried about our tower because we already took a lot of damage in his second tower too you can see one tower is very healthy our tower so I again went with the balloon and that was easy uh, tower for us so we went in defense now because we need to defense everything his pickup push will be probably very bad right now so he has electro wizard for inferno dragon so I know you'll probably do Electro Wizard so I went with the Minion Heart and you'll use the arrows. I went with the aggressive Mega Knight on the Ewis. Here you can see how I managed to defense very easily. You, she had used to. Okay that was a good game because he didn't focus on the Balloon. I used he was aggressive so that's an easy matchup for us guys. Not easy but I made it easy. Okay. We are at 1828 currently and let's go into one match. Let's see if we can win this one too. It might take some time to get some matches because we are a little bit high. Not too high but a little bit. Okay. We finally got the match against a heart of Masat. Okay, Masat. Let's see what he's playing. Mm, let's see. Okay, I think he's playing a Bridge Spam deck. So we'll just cycle a minions on the back of the king tower and we have this ice golem for okay We have this ice golem for Bandit he might use electro wizard. No, I think he doesn't have a cycle of electro wizard So he didn't use he might go with the dark. Okay. He's, he has a battle ram too. We'll go with this And he might do fireball or something like that. Okay, he has zap So you will go with probably with electro wizard right now because I went with the minor Probably electro wizard, yeah. 
you will go you might go with the royal ghost too okay you went with the bandit aggressive so we went to okay oh that was a fine i think he doesn't have elixir for pick i don't think he has a pick i think i don't know he has got no he doesn't has got the pick so we went aggressive there can we get the mega knight sort that's the point yes we can okay oh my god what a zap currently you can you know that he doesn't have Okay, he's we spell out a fireball chap. Now he only has a magic archer. So we will go with a balloon and a minion heart. So let's go with that. He only has the answer is magic archer. I don't think he has. Oh, electro wizard. But that's fine for us. That was our plan. Can you get a touch? Oh my god. Uh, okay, that was fine though. We got some damage, but I expected to get a touch. Oh my god. Okay, I think the tower is over for us. Okay, okay we... Okay, let's go for good. He had dropped the P.E.K.K.A down there. So we need to defend this pretty good right now. I went with this. I don't know how can I defend this but we need to defend this. Okay. The point is can we defend that. Uh, the point is can we defend that okay it will probably use the pick out there okay he doesn't use the pick right now he doesn't use the pick that was a good game oh my god that was the game that we need you can see what a match what a play i thought we lost the tower we lose but we still def trying to defend and we defended that you can see there was a pretty awesome match against odd with a pekka deck again so this is how you play this deck you can see right now we are 6752 and let's grab this 50 gems up and let's see where we are you can see we are currently 1415 i think this pekka this spam deck is all over the tower you can see he is a good player he is of 18 win tournament badges he has also got Pekka matchup is pretty hard for us, but we still manage to win because he has a Firewall, Electro Wizard, Zap, Magic Archer, all out that, but we still manage to win. This is how you play this deck. I hope you like the video and guys, subscribe and enjoy the video. And if you want to learn this deck, you can watch other videos. And the main key of this deck is you have to know what cards they use, uh, what spells do the opponent has and the cycle of the opponent as well as the elixir he spent it. So this is how you play this deck. This deck is quite easy, you don't need any skill to play this deck. So hope you enjoy the video guys. Try to win the trophy. Uh, let's see, this season we'll try to get top 1000. Obviously we have quite good badges like 20 wins 2 times. Badge of these 5 years. Uh, yeah. That's all guys, thank you.